What's going on guys, Steven Salon Guy here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to curl your hair with a flat iron, or what I like to call a smoothing iron. So I'm ready to go, let's get started. So there's a number of different things you can do to create waves or curls with a flat iron, all right? So let's start with the first one, where this is something that we'll see, it's fairly common, right? So what we're gonna do is I like to just smooth it over one time, just like this, just to kind of you know, seal the hair off a little bit and it helps get the process going. So then what we'll do is we'll turn the iron towards us, right? And then there's that piece, that end piece right there. And what we're gonna do is we're simply going to just pull the iron towards us, just like that. And then there we have a little bit of a curl, all right? As you can see, just like this. Right, just from that one little piece, <clears throat> just from that one little twist and that turn of the iron towards us and holding that hair, and now we have a nice bouncy curl like so. Then what you can do with it if you want, if you're looking to create more of like pin curls or uh, more of like a finger wave type look, you can simply just take that, lock the hair in like this, and you can roll it into a pin curl and clip it like so. So sometimes if you actually go in too harshly with the iron, you can actually create a dent into here. So again, let's go in through one time. And instead of going horizontally with the iron, we're actually gonna go vertically like this. We're gonna turn it and we're going to keep turning. There's that piece right there. And now we're fully locked in. And same thing, we're going to pull the hair. And there we have, again, a little bit of a softer wave. But as you can see, instead of coming in this way, we actually turn the iron vertically. And that actually really helps prevent any sort of lines of demarcation or any sort of dents in the hair with the iron. So a lot of times, this is actually the safest way to go about doing that is by doing it vertically. Okay, once again, we're gonna go over the iron. We're gonna go over the hair with the iron one time. And what I'm gonna be doing with this is kind of like a rock and roll. So we're gonna lock it in and we're gonna rock and roll, rock and roll down like this. And what that's doing is it's actually gonna be creating kind of like finger waves in the hair. So let's go in, let's rock it, let's roll it down. Again, let's rock it, let's roll it down, rock it, roll it down, and all the way down to the end. And as you can see here, we just created a very, very soft, uh, slight finger wave right in through here. All right, again, this is some, if somebody is looking for just a little bit of a soft bend in through the hair, see if you can see this here, see that? We create a nice little bit of a wave. Again, rock, roll, rock and roll. It's basically just twisting, twisting like this. All right, so because this outside of the iron does get relatively hot and warm, you know, a lot of times with curling irons, you wrap the hair around the outside of the iron. So what we're gonna do here is we're actually gonna wrap the hair around the outside of the uh, smoothing iron or the flat iron, and we're just gonna hold it for, uh, let's say five seconds. So one, two, three, four, five. Now, we're gonna hold on to this end piece right here, and we're gonna unwind, and literally what that did is, as you can see here, it created such a very, very soft, loose bend in the hair, right in through here. Again, I'm not looking for like a massive curl, but as you can see, we've got a little bit of that movement right in through here. And sometimes that's what, what people are looking for. They just want a little, little bit of a slight uh, wave down into the bottom and through here, as you can see, right? So again, another little trick. And let's do one last one. All right, so now we're gonna again, we're gonna turn this towards us. We're gonna keep going, and now we'll get a twist again, right? If you want even curlier hair and even more of a stronger wave, we're gonna twist again towards us, start to slightly release a little bit here, because it will get a bit tight, and we're gonna keep turning and turning until the end of the hair comes all the way through, like so, and then we can actually roll it up, almost like if this was a curling iron. So we're gonna hold this here for a few seconds, and I like to tap on the hair here to see how warm it's getting. 
And when I feel that actually the hair is, is a bit warm, then I'll say, okay, it's time to go through. So then simply we'll just unravel the iron like so. And then look at this. Now we've got a pretty strong spiral curl right into the front here. And then what you can do is you can rake your fingers to it and create some sort of longer beach wave. All right. Again, as you can see right through here. So these types of curls or these types of techniques are good for creating stronger types of waves, you know, um, things that if you're looking for something a bit more, I don't know, say a little bit softer or you want to have, you know, a bit more of a non-traditional type curl or some bouncing through some areas of the hair, then these are really, really good um, techniques and methods of using a flat iron to get any sort of waves or curls in your hair. And then as you see here, by just playing around with it with your fingers or combing the hair through, you know, running your fingers through it, you're able to get uh, a bit of a nice wave and, it's, and, and it allows you to kind of soften uh, it up a bit. So I hope you found this video helpful. Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time for more videos with the Salon Guy.